can't find it. Show up. Please. I just want to play. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Game Commentary with Everything Horror Podcast. Today we are playing The Beach Inside, a Kickstarter demo that we backed and can't wait to see what the final product brings. So uh, let's dive right in. Starting. What have I done to you? What, what, what do you want? Do you want money? You can have it. You can have it. You can have anything you want. Please. I promise. I won't tell anyone. You're wearing a mask. I, I don't even know what you look like. Please. Please. My husband, Adam, he should be back any minute. No. No, no. What do you, what do you need an ask for? I get very um, into the game per se. this time, Emma? I don't want to walk five miles to the nearest gas station again. Oh, sweetie. A little walk and some fresh mountain air would be good for you. Plus, you could lose some weight. kind of choppy here. Working on it. Working on it, okay? Look at him. We're finally here. It's wonderful. Looks like the moving company got here before us. So, let's get to work. Alright, um, I apologize for that little choppy thing right there. I really do. For people. Hey, uh, could you take those boxes inside, please? Sure thing, huh? Chapter 1. Home sweet home. So, one thing I will say is like, uh, Our dear son, this house belongs to our family for many decades, even called it, even some 
But when me and your dad moved to Boston, we thought Grandpa was just gonna sell it, as he said he would. Well, he didn't. Surprisingly, he left it for us in his will. And now you and your lovely wife will live here. Raise your kids and simply enjoy life far away from the turmoil of our dangerous time. I can't even imagine a better place to settle down. Take good care of Emma. We'll visit you sometime next month if my aching hip allows that. Mom. P.S. Dad thinks he should be the one to come up with a name for your son or daughter. I have no idea why he's insisting on that. Maybe he's just getting old and tries to leave some kind of legacy. Anyway, act surprised when he mentions it to you. Okay, I guess we're just gonna throw it on the ground, I guess. Getting my fingers mixed up again. Look at this house, I guess. Um, give me that. Uh, I'll prepare for major weather. Interesting. Okay. Nice environment, though. I like the environment, very well clean. Uh, once again, I am playing this on 30 frames per second, but it's pretty nice. Um, so, let's see what we do here. I do kind of hope later down the road we may see this game on. Uh, Council to have a much more. Uh, the assholes got the money up front, so they didn't bother putting the boxes in the attic. No one can be trusted these days. Yeah. Uh, customer name on contract. I don't see them the pickup address. Boston, Massachusetts. One Mill Street, Seven Dover address. Blackstone 13, Connecticut. Total charge is $670. General overview of work, transportation of 8 to 10 boxes, 33 pounds each for furniture for some equipment to home. home improvement, renovation, 170 miles in one way, customer signature, Adam Stevenson, union signature doctor. Yeah, you got screwed, buddy. But just admit the fact that you just got screwed. Painfully. Um, I've kind of seen a little, like, I've seen enough videos to know what I'm kind of doing here. But, uh, yeah. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. This is kind of weird because... What the hell is in here? Your shoes? I 
Sweetie, do you have a key for this? here I don't see it in the dining room it's not here that's right I, I must have left them in the car in the car oh yeah now you let me put the fucking thing Box next to the others. Next to the others. Must be this one. Let's see what we have here. Hmm. Looks like I'm going to need a tool to pry this plank open. So I did just found a crowbar. Let's see if this fixed the door. Floor. Please let it be money. Please let it be money. I'm gonna not lie, I've seen the video so many times, I know what the answer is. Um, yeah. Thank you, YouTubers. Um, but yeah, the idea though is like this. Unfortunately, I don't even know Latin, and uh, I know, I know pretty bad. Yeah, so here's the machine that you're, you were supposed to use to find face, but, um, let's see here. Walk over there. We've got another key now. We got Nicholas key or Nikolai's key. It's an antique key and what does it unlock? I guess we're gonna have to find out. Property of Nicholas. 27th of September, 1864. Exactly like 27th of September, 1864. This place looks exactly like on the day I left it. So many years have passed away. Only the overwhelming silence helps me distinguish past from present. Maybe the best would be not to think about it. I better check if everything is in its own place. It is getting late. I should find some candles to light up while there's still some light. They told me that it would be a good idea to start writing down everything. So be it. They know better than I do. Alright. Time to read my diary. Find some candles, huh? Okay. Well, first of all... Oh, 
move. Oh, oh, oh. I'm completely dumb, guys. I apologize. Oh, here we go. Look at this. So we got 11 matches. Try to match. Um, the things weren't in my way, but it's a picture. My father and associate the early days of their pirate maroon mine my bad the mine interesting I love how you just throw the book alright so something about moving heavy object there we go yeah get out of my way Preemption. My father bought this land for next to nothing. His friend Judge Norton signed off the document and the deal was done. That's how they handled things back then. Rotate to find a message. Father knew what was in the ground and he just needed someone who had the means of, for opening the mine here. That's when he met George. Later, he built the inn and made stacks of money. Good old days, I guess. Oh, boy. Here we go. A lantern. Upstairs. Oh. Oh, now something happened, so that I gotta go upstairs now. Anybody? Hope it didn't fall down that well. God, what a day. I better check the area.
what the hell am I gonna be using bolt cutters for? Oh, right, the lock. I bet. What's that? back outside oh man we gotta get behind this over there so oh you weren't open before turn this on got right here it's just old ash what it is. What's this? Nothing. We got a grinder here. Oh. What is this? Paranormal activity now? Come on now. Stop it. Stop it. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Uh, hope you got to doing okay. Uh, my hand is definitely not used to the uh, keyboard and mouse. Like I said, I'm used to like controllers. And the setup that I'm using right now isn't really the best per se, but it, it is what it is. And uh, there we go. devil you oh, there's blood sounds like a good time I apologize guys I'm freaking sad
got going, going on here. Would have been a jump scare, I should say. But I must I'm gonna say it again, the environment looks amazing for this. And I just can't wait to see the actual full game a little bit more. And uh, this will be out next year. Um, I think I heard something about like January, I believe, was going to be the uh, the idea. And, yeah. Got over here. Find some more matches. Do, do the toolbox. It's a small pocket. I think there can be something useful inside. Walk pick. Aha. Uh -huh. So can I walk pick this then? No. Uh. Okay. Finally! Oh, right. Um. Fuck you. Get over here. God damn it. Fucking controls. Okay, so that was the Beats Inside demo. Um, for a new PC and stuff, this is kind of pathetic to have choppy stuff going on. Um, not too impressed. Otherwise, environment looks good, but choppiness is really, really bad. Um, I hope that oh that they fix some of this stuff i mean i've seen other youtubers play this just fine but i mean it's a start i guess for us um depending on which i apologize for if you even made it this far awesome and um yeah i think that's it so do will i recommend it really um yeah i mean i would it's got some potential. Um, the jump scares, though, are interesting. Not, not um, um, everybody can kind of tell you I'm hard to scare. So, uh, people that get scared, keep up the good work, I guess. Could that help promote the game? Um, otherwise, um, maybe try to make it not so jump scary, I guess. Because that does get it quite annoying. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video, and as always, stay scared.